This is the bone wedge model. On the bone wedge model, we have on the outside the periosteum. Periosteum is connected to the bone tissue by these white structures called perforating fibers. And then on the inside, in here, that grayish material is the end osteum. Look down at the bone structure, we see that we have these concentric rings forming around a hole. This entire structure is called the osteon, so this whole thing is an osteon. The hole in the middle, that is a central canal. Each ring, so each ring, boom, 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 each ring in an osteon is called a concentric lamina. The tiny little spaces we see, these little pockets, are called the lacuna. The osteocytes live in the lacuna. Again, this is the central canal. There are little faint lines that you can't see in this video. These little faint lines going through the lamina, those little faint lines are called one caniculus, many caniculi. When we have lamina in between osteons, these are called interstitial lamina. When we have lamina on the outside or inside going all the way around, these laminas are called the circumferential lamina. Also, we have tunnels going the width of the bone. These are referred to as perforating canals. So perforating canals go the width of the bone. And that is it for this model.